Hello everyone, Randy here again. We're playing Farming Simulator 15. And for today's pull-off, we have a Crone Big X 1100. I don't know why, folks, but I had a lot of requests to try the combines up against the quad track. Uh, in particular, the uh, Crone Big X here. Now, I don't think, folks, I can get the uh, combines to actually attach with the tow bar here. Because the attacher points for the uh, combines are up under the combine. So I don't think this uh, tow bar is long enough. But the uh, Crone Big X here, we can uh, make this one work. So we're going to give this a try. Uh, like I said, I don't know why uh, so many people are interested in seeing if the uh, chopper here can outpull the quad track. But uh, we are going to give this a try. So what do you folks think? Going to be the quad track or the Crone? Now the Crone, I believe, is 1,100 horsepower according to the game, if I remember correctly. No, 1,034, I guess. Okay, so 1,034 horsepower. So about um, extra 400 horsepower over the uh, quad track. Uh, the quad track has up to 692, I guess. So, which one do you folks think will win? Uh, real life, folks. It's going to the quad track. I don't think the uh, the uh, big X here even has a chance of uh, out pulling the the uh, quad track, at least not in real life anyway, uh, for two reasons. One, the quad track here, folks, is a tractor. It is designed for pulling, and number two, it has tracks. Definitely a distinct advantage there with uh, tracks. So let's uh, get this set up here, and we'll uh, see what's what happens. So we need course one. Oh, you're already loaded. Excellent. Well, we just need to get this one set up then. Course two on you. That should be good. Just tell him to start at the nearest waypoint as long as he doesn't back up and go to that one. That should be okay. Now, I've never done this with a uh, combine of any sorts before, so I'm not sure how this will work. I'm assuming it should work just fine. Um, I guess we'll find out. In fact, let's uh, turn all that on. And we'll tell you to drive the course. Go to the first waypoint. Actually, just make sure he's set to use four-wheel drive here, too. That way, just make sure it's on. Technically, doesn't matter because, like I said, course play will turn it on. So, okay, let's see what's what happens. Uh, it isn't actually not out pulling the uh, crone so far. Oh, yep, it's out pulling the crone, folks. Okay. I wasn't sure in the game, folks, which one would win. I was kind of thinking the quad track was going to win, but I wasn't sure. And looks like, yes, the quad track is indeed winning slightly. Not like a super distinct advantage here, but it is definitely winning. The uh, crone here actually isn't even spinning its tires. Okay, let's just uh, see once it makes a difference. We'll tell prone to go on course play as well. Okay, folks, I think we can definitely uh, call it at this point. Definitely uh, the uh, quad track here is winning. Now, just for the fun of it, let's uh, stop you a minute. And I want to try, let's say, maybe the new Holland against it. You know, something with tires. Maybe something a little more fair, shall we say, folks. Uh, let's see. Let's detach the crone here. Uh, the tow bar is attached to the crone, by the way. Uh, like I mentioned in the past, the uh, quad track does not have the required high hitch. Um, why are you not detached? Oh, I see why. There we go. Okay, make sure the uh, tow bar is selected there. Yeah, like I was saying, the uh, quad track does not have the uh, required high hitch to actually attach to the tow bar. Okay, and let's see once. Shall we just get the in-game New Holland, I guess? The T9565, a little bit less horsepower. So at this point, the Crone actually has double the horsepower of the uh, T9 here. But uh, like I said before, folks, uh, in real life, it doesn't necessarily come down to horsepower. It comes down to traction. 
which is determined, by the way, by horsepower and weight. Okay, attached. Now let's get the new Holland here set up. And this will be course one. Tell him start at the first waypoint and drive the course. Doesn't appear to be going anywhere to me, folks. From what I'm seeing anyway, let's uh, find out. Nope, we are going backwards now. Okay. I am uh, trying to drive here, by the way. I know the tires aren't spinning, but, um, yep, yeah, it won't even spin the tires. Okay, so the new Holland is winning. Let's just see if course play can do anything here. That uh, course play is spinning the tires. Looks like it has at least uh, slowed the momentum slightly, maybe. I'm not actually seeing any movement here, folks. I see the uh, New Holland's kind of like moving a little bit, but then it's like getting pulled back, so. Let's take a real close look here. Nope, folks, I don't see any movement, so I think we can call that. Uh, the quad track can definitely out pull, at least in the game here, the uh, Corona Big X. Like I said, folks, I'm pretty sure it won't even be a competition in real life. The uh, quad track there should definitely be able to pull the uh, big X. Uh, as far as the New Holland goes, uh, real life folks, I'm pretty sure the New Holland would win against the big X as well. But in the game here, looks like it's a dead tie, I'm going to say, for the New Holland and the big X. Anyway, with that, folks, I uh, hope you folks enjoyed this uh, video. Uh, if you folks have any comments or questions, be sure to uh, leave them below. Also, if you folks want to see any particular combination of tractor, let me know. And as always, folks, thanks for watching, and till next time.